new developments, a local woman who survived a flesh-eating bacteria is now the first person in the world to use an advanced prosthetic system. And today we're getting our first look at how the prosthetic is improving Amy Copeland's life. Amy, my goodness, you're making history. Oh, you're making thank history. You. On ABC's Good Morning America, Amy Copeland shared the latest chapter in her remarkable journey. The Gwinnett County woman is now the first quadruple amputee to wear this kind of advanced prosthetic system. She says it's life changing. The first time I tried them on, it was like totally different than anything I'd ever experienced. They just felt like a part of me, an extension of my natural arm, just like the real thing. The groundbreaking prosthesis are created by the California company BioDesigns. What we do is a, is a patented way of compressing and releasing around the tissue so that the bone inside is fixated or stabilized so that it feels like a part of you, becomes a part of you instead of something attached to you. Copeland is a true survivor. We first introduced you to her in 2012. She contracted a flesh-eating bacteria after she fell from a zip line near the Tallapoosa River. Doctors later performed several amputations. Today, ABC's Robin Roberts asked Copeland about her message to others. Compassion was a huge part of my healing. When you're helping others, you're not focused on yourself. You're not focused on what you're lacking. It makes you grateful. And Copeland is crediting her family and her friends with getting her through her darkest days. Today, she said, quote, all you need is love, and we're so happy for this new development. She looks amazing. The most positive person that we've put on our newscast. It's just incredible. Absolutely. Sam